Hello guys, and um, this is a video basically just about Liverpool. Um, I support Liverpool, and I'm sure quite a lot of you will know that. But um, I'm just saying, why should, why is everybody saying like Liverpool? Are rub well, Liverpool have got no chance of the top four, and Liverpool have got no chance of you know getting in a decent position because it's all bull. I mean, Liverpool have got a great squad and I don't know why people are saying that because they have got, in my opinion, one of the best in the Premier League squad. So I just don't see why they're getting so much shit thrown at them because oh, it's just so difficult. They're just a good team that need time to gel and I just think that Given that time, they could be one of the best teams in the Prem. So, yeah, so this is just a video of me like, putting putting my favourite squads that Liverpool have together and um, stuff like that. So, um, yeah. Just trying to find Skirtle, wherever you are. Skirtle, where are you? What the fuck? There he is. Right, okay, so, yeah, it's just a video. I mean, look at this team, though. I, I don't... Anyway, right, wait there. Why should that team there be saying, oh, look, what a crap... Liver like, United fans, oh, you got a crap team. Well, what? how have they got a crap team? Sturridge, Suarez, Sterling, like, three really amazing players. Lucas, Gerrard, Allen. I mean, three class midfield players I don't see what is wrong with them at all then you got like that defence what what that's one of the best defence in the Premier League in my opinion and you got Rayner of course he's not in the best of form but he is a brilliant goalkeeper so um that's a good team Liverpool could go with to play some teams but another team they could go with is a is that all the formations they've got oh, well that one that one Right, okay. So, why they could play this team as well. Um, put him there. So, um, I'm just basically putting a load of Liverpool teams together that are good. And I, see, I don't see why they shouldn't play well in real life, sort of. And there's no excuses now for Liverpool. If Liverpool don't come top six, that's absolutely ridiculous because this team now, the quality in it, that would just be awful, to be honest. So, um, it's just ridiculous. I mean, Everton's team, yeah, they're doing good. They're doing really good at the moment. But it's nowhere near as quality as Liverpool's team. I'm sorry if any of you are Liverpool, uh, Everton fans, but I mean... Come on, you have to be honest. Well, you you haven't really got a Suarez, have you, or a Gerard? You know, you haven't really got any player as good as them. Uh, what am I looking for? I'm looking for Gerard. There he is. Right. So um, yeah. So that's another good team Liverpool could put. Uh, was Enrique, and now we need. Where the hell is Lucas? There he is. So, right now, there we go. Right, so, I mean, why isn't that team good enough, you know? We've got a few decent players. Like Downing, he's not in the best of form in real life, but think back, um, let's say, I don't know, two years, and he was an absolute boss player. He was probably just as good as Ashley Young. So, I mean, Ashley Young's a beast in real life, I must admit that, and he's a United player, so yeah. But, um, even so, right, watch, I'm going to build a team now which hasn't got any of these players in, and you, you can't really say it's bad. Right, maybe the worst player in the team will be Brad Jones, but even he's not even that bad in real life.
So, um, yeah, I'm just building this. See what I mean, though? So far, Barini, Pacheco, they're two really good players. Asaidi, good player. Henderson, good player. Kelly, good player. Quartes, good, really, really good potential. Um, Shelby, obviously, good player. Um, I'm basically downing as a second team player. I know I just put him in that one just now before this, but that was sort of mixing it around a bit. Just trying to find. Liverpool do need a new centre back, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. Jack Robinson's a very decent player as well. Um, still young, still loads of potential. We actually haven't got, we've only got three centre backs according to this. I can't see another one. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry. Let's just put Flanagan in there for now. But, I mean, look at that. I mean, you can't look at that team and then go, oh, look, he's awful. I mean, there isn't really anyone who is awful in it. Like Henderson, and he's had a lot of stick, but he isn't even that. He's he's decent. He's getting he's getting good in the centre defending mid role, and I think that's really important because he's getting his strength and he's sort of getting away from players, passing nicely. He's doing really good. And uh, oh, there we go. Sorry, I'm so blind. So yeah, Carragher. <laughs> um, you could say Jones is awful, I suppose, but in my opinion, he's he's all right and. Oh, I bet I'm sounding well biased this video, but I'm going to be doing this, uh, this is going to be kind of a squad selector series, where I do like the top maybe seven teams in the Prem, top eight including Liverpool, and um, so we're going to be doing City, United, Tottenham, um, Everton, Arsenal, Chelsea, Liverpool, which I've just done, which is seven, I don't know, we might throw in, like, Newcastle. I don't know, maybe. Um, yeah, so... So, yeah. Oh, yeah, another big bit of news. Well, I know it was actually quite a few weeks ago, but I've just got back from a holiday. Bar went to Chelsea. Good signing for uh, Chelsea there. But they give Sturridge to us, and I think Sturridge is an absolute tank of a player on FIFA and in real life, so, yeah. Yeah, so, guys, thank you for watching this um, video. This is... Um, a new series that's going to be going on, Squad Selector, and um, yeah, so uh, thank you for watching this video, hope you enjoyed, and uh, hopefully you can see what I mean by why Liverpool, they're not crap, they just sort of need to gel, so thank you for watching my video, see you later.